Um, in this case, Mr. George, George Floyd died from a cardiopulmonary arrest. It was caused by low oxygen levels, and those low oxygen levels were induced by the prone restraint and positional asphyxiation that he was subjected to. So had he not been restrained in the way in which he was, I think he would have survived that day. I think he would have gone home or wherever he was going to go had he not been subjected to the prone and positional restraint that he was. So in other words, if he had gotten in the squad car, he'd be alive. Um, I think my answer remains the same. Anything other than that scenario that he was subjected to, I have no reason to think from a medical perspective that he would not have survived that day, correct? 